Hello everyone and welcome back. Today I'm diving into a game that many of you might have forgotten, but it is etched deeply into my heart. I am talking about the iconic Heart of Darkness, a PlayStation 1 classic that I firmly believe is the only remake we truly need. Stick around because I'm about to take you on a journey through the video game that captured me back in 1998 and made me fall in love with video games. Trust me, by the end of this video you'll be craving for a modern day revival just as much as I do. I'm going to show you a couple of minutes of gameplay right now and just look at the graphics and for not to mention the fun gameplay and take a close look at the enemies because the enemies in this game had a lot of humor. Take a look. This game meant a lot to me as a kid. I think I was around 8 years old when I started playing it. Heart of Darkness showed me what video games really could be and I was totally blown away and literally glued to my little television. Heart of Darkness showed me that video games was really interactive movies where I was in control and made all of the decisions. It was so insane to me that a video game had puzzles where I had to use my own brain to think outside the box on how to get to the next level. Never had I ever at that age experienced a video game with these qualities. For those who might not know, Heart of Darkness was a cinematic platformer that stood out with its stunning visuals, challenging gameplay, and a storyline that pulled no punches. It was a game that dared to be different in an era dominated by 3D graphics and was an unforgettable experience for anyone who played it. I remember being completely mesmerized by the dark, eerie atmosphere and the captivating cutscenes. The game follows Andy, a young boy on a mission to rescue his dog, Whiskey, from the clutches of an evil shadow entity. Sounds simple, right? But what made Heart of Darkness special was its ability to blend a touching narrative with intense and sometimes downright brutal gameplay. And for an 8 year old like me, the puzzles was just as brutal. 
The game was unforgiving yet incredibly rewarding. Each level was carefully crafted, combining puzzle solving with platforming in ways that kept you on the edge of your seat. And let's not forget the beautifully orchestrated soundtrack that set the perfect tone for every moment of the game. Of course it wasn't as orchestrated as modern games, but for a game that released in 1998, this game was way ahead of its time both in storyline, gameplay, puzzles and graphics. Now imagine this, Heart of Darkness remade with today's technology, enhanced graphics that bring the eerie environments back to life, improved mechanics for smoother gameplay and perhaps even additional content that expands on Andy's adventure, maybe even some missions with Whiskey after we saved him. The potential is limitless with this game and the original game laid such a strong foundation that a remake could easily elevate it to a legendary status. We have literally seen so many remakes and remasters of our beloved games these past years, but Heart of Darkness remains a hidden gem that deserves the spotlight once more. It is time for a new generation of gamers to experience the magic and for us veterans to relive the adventures in a whole new light. So what do you think? Are you ready to journey back into the Heart of Darkness? If you enjoyed this dive into gaming nostalgia and believe in the power of a good remake as much as I do, hit that like button, subscribe and share your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching and as always, until next time.